So we just left the shelter and the AT decided to take us up this massive climb. Whew, it's a tough one. But there's a big payoff. There's the James River back there, what we just crossed over yesterday on the largest footbridge on the AT. And today, we're going to Buena Vista. Wow, so we decided to do 28 miles today and we're almost to the top of the summit. It's getting late, we're about to headlamp it, but man, it's totally worth it just for stuff like this. We are in Waynesboro, Virginia now. We got in last night and uh, we arrived at Rockfish Gap and we needed a ride into town. And we looked down on the fence and there's a list of trail angels that you can call to come pick you up and take you where you need to go. They uh, actually took us to get ice cream when they picked us up before they took us to the town park where you can camp for free there. They have a pavilion where you can charge your cell phones. They have solar chargers there. Plenty of places for tents. And then there's the library here that has free Wi-Fi that's really close to that too. Mark's actually in there downloading the next video. Um, the Kroger, which is pretty close to the park as well, where you can go do your resupply. It's got great selection there. There's tons of places to eat. There's a Ming garden buffet we had that today it was delicious it's like 750 for the lunch buffet pretty cheap there's a laundry facility pretty close as well everybody here has been so hospitable it's got the YMCA where you can shower for free too so yeah Waynesboro I think you take the cake for the best trail town so far thank you So today we are leaving Waynesboro and we're kind of sad because it's such a great town and we met some really, really cool people, some really nice people, but today we're starting the Shenandoah. That's right baby, it's going to be beautiful, we've got sunny skies, it's warm, and we're about to head in there now and we're going to conquer the Shenandoah National Park. In the Shenandoah for only an hour and a half, guess what I just saw? A black bear stared him right in his face and he ran away as fast as possible. It was awesome. It's the first time I've ever seen a bear. 
outside of the zoo. What an experience. National Park. We are on Black Rock Mountain right now and we actually saw what we think is a bobcat this morning. So we've seen a bear, a bobcat, and multiple snakes. So there's a lot of wildlife out here. So today should be pretty interesting. We might go to a wayside and even get a milkshake too. But for now we're just gonna take in this view. I'm not sure if you can see this, but there's a black bear right over there. Check it out. So we are sitting here at Rattlesnake Overlook and we're about to be out of the Shenandoah tomorrow. We're headed into Front Royal to resupply and we're going to be heading into Harpers Ferry, West Virginia soon. So we will finally be out of Virginia. It's been a long time here. We're ready for a new state. Four miles in West Virginia and we're headed to Pennsylvania. Here we come. We got into our shelter super late last night, it's like 10 o'clock, trying not to wake up all the other hikers. But we're out here this morning, it's around 8.30, we're heading into Front Royal. We're gonna upload a video, get some McDonald's, resupply at Martin's, and we're taking it easy today. We're doing 18.6 miles, and we're heading to a shelter with a shower and a front porch. It's gonna be an awesome day. Oh, boy, am I hungry. And we are getting out of the Shenandoah. It's Memorial Day weekend, so let's just say it was quite crowded with weekenders this time. Um, but yeah, we're pretty excited to be moving on. And we're gonna get McDonald's and Front Royal. Oh yeah. Well, we're sitting outside of Front Royal. We're on 522, we're trying to get a ride. And there's been a lot of cars already pass us. It's Memorial Day weekend, so I think a lot of them are tourists. They don't really know what we're doing out here. I guess we're kind of scary to them. Hopefully, within the next hour or two, we get a ride because we're really hungry. And we got to get back to the trail to do five more miles. So hopefully somebody's kind enough to stop for us. We'll see. Well, to answer your question, we did get a ride into Front Row. It was a very nice lady gave us a ride. We went to McDonald's. Ate some more good food, went to Martin's, resupplied, went back to Burger King, ate a ice cream cone and a milkshake, 
And now we made a speedy return in only five hours back to the trail. That's right, we're gonna be doing some night hiking again tonight. Looks like we're making that a tradition.